Hey everybody, welcome back. Alright, so we got a few more places to loot here before we move on to the next level. And hopefully we don't have to deal with Sir the Giant Beast. But we'll see how that goes. These uh, Reeves, we can give these to Darren. And then that way I can give him these other steel cap shoes as well. There we are. Alright, actually we can give him this helmet too. It's a fantastic helmet. I need my current helmet to see in the dark though. So that's why Darren gets it. So I'm hoping to find some leggings here. A salve works too. Doesn't look like we're going to find the leggings. That's somewhat disappointing. Should be one more of these skeletons here. Yep. All right. Um, Darren's going to need a better weapon. This is not bad at all, this flanged mace. Let him have that. Alright, here's the bracelet that's going to help us recover our stamina more quickly. Alright, so it is time to move on to the crossroads. We've gotten everything that we need from here, basically. And we never crossed paths with Sir, so that is excellent. the skeleton to be a little closer. Uh, I don't even need to look at those. We've got the cloth legging situation figured out. Alright, there's a blue 
Crystal. We definitely want all the crystals we can find. failed. Did we take extra red health damage from that? We may have. Nothing that we could use in any of those containers. It's kind of disappointing. Whatever. Get this skeleton to come through the door. Whoops. Good thing I hit Darren's shield. I'm not Darren. nothing. Alright, we have learned barricade. Now we're going to work on wave. Alright, there's a green crystal. Excellent. Darren. I killed him, but I'll take it. All right. Uh, no. Sometimes there's a blade master in here, but not this time. I get. Oh no! Yeah, there he is. Yeah, we're gonna want to kill that guy. I would hit him with bolt, but then he'll probably run away. Eh, let's try it anyway. And then I missed. And yes, he is running. Oh, come on, man. Try to... Ah. I guess, yeah, he went over here. Oh, he's trying... Yeah. He's a little confused. Eh, you gotta, you gotta pull this lever, man. Well, I wasn't expecting it to be this easy. Okay. Alright, well, we don't need this anymore. We're gonna take a, take the Blade Master swords instead. 
All right. Okay, so let's backtrack. Click this uh, spider here. Another blue crystal. By the way, we can get rid of that spiked club now. And we learned union, which means we can finally work on maneuvering an armor three to lower our encumbrance. There's an amber crystal. We've collected them all. For the amber crystal, you only need one of those. But for the green and blue, you want as many as you can find, especially the blue ones. We're going inside. This mace is really powerful with strikes on. It's, uh, it's slow, of course, but uh, it's really powerful. There's a map of the crossroads. Sphere. Uh, these are some nice hardened shoes here. Yeah, I'm going to take those and give these to Baron. Dang it. There we go. And a half sap, my goodness. All right, that works. We'll make some room and move in here. Oh, that's... okay. Get him, Darren. There you go. Okay, I'm just gonna fall over this chair real quick. Alright, nice job. Alright, time to fight the captain. Right into that. Oh, man. All right. Man, he went flying with that one hit. That was great. Get this out of the way. There we go. Alright, another upgrade sphere. Alright, we're not going to 
to take any of this captain's armor here, but we will take this blue crystal. That's always there. to venture into the sewers next. So slash damage is going to be what we want. Uh, so we'll use that Blade Master sword and then give Darren the other one. If Darren ever catches up with us. There he is. There we go. And I don't need the torch to see right now, but it is helpful in the sewers, because the sewers are pretty dark. Even with the sea and the dark helmet. turning the lights on so that I can find my way back eventually and also so I can know where I've gone Are you kidding me? The very first chest this time has the socketed sword, man. So this sword loses its uh, slash damage really quickly as you use it, unless you put a green crystal in there. And we just so happen to have a green crystal. It will drain, but uh, it's worth it. And I'm pretty sure... Whoops. I'm sh I, I want to say it even goes higher than five, doesn't it? I don't know. I don't remember. So it either stays at five when you have the green crystal in it, or it goes up. And we one-tapped him. I think it stays at five. All right. Of course, that's a, a lot of damage. Any time now, Dan. Any time. Okay, another upgrade sphere. Excellent. Trying not to hit Darren. I'm messing myself up. Wow, those are some nice greaves. Uh, better than Darren's. Uh. You know, yeah, give me those. And then there's a Bever to cover the rest of our face. Very nice. Alright, this is where we're going to end this episode. Thank you, as always, for hanging out, everybody. I appreciate it. Please hit like and subscribe if you would like to. And I will see you all next time.